10 Jobs That Will Disappear Tomorrow Technology is moving incredibly fast, always evolving and changing in the blink of an eye. But this also has a negative effect on many traditional careers that had become more automated, more so during this pandemic. Knowing this, it is crucial to avoid choosing an industry that is conformed of disappearing jobs. Welcome to the 9 to 5 Rebel. In today's video, we'll take a look at our countdown of the 10 jobs bound to disappear in the near future. Remember to stay until the end and don't forget to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to receive more incredible content like this. Postal Careers Almost 60% of young people in Australia are currently training for careers that will be partly automated in the next 10 to 15 years. That is a considerable waste of skills. If you're considering any of the following careers, try to think twice. Even though we will still need couriers to deliver parcels, things are not looking suitable for the traditional postman or woman delivering letters every day. This is happening because the things that they provide won't exist in the next 20 years. Statements and bills are paid and viewed online. Junk mail is now in your email inbox rather than your mailbox, and the art of writing and sending letters is kind of dying. Despite this, companies still ask you for a utility bill to prove your address. Sports Referees and Umpires If you've ever thought to dedicate your life to be a referee or an umpire, chances are your services won't be needed in the future. Soccer's governing body, FIFA, is complying with pressure to include more technology into the game. With goal line technology, top European leagues are using standard, and the Video Assistant Referee VAR system. Other sports follow this example, like tennis, cricket and rugby, which have been using technology to make real-time decisions during a match. You also see the enhanced camera capabilities currently enrolled in the NFL and NBA. Librarians Although ebooks and digital book devices have succeeded all around the world, there will always be books among us. But the position of librarians is in danger. Many public libraries are having a hard time trying to stay open. The governments have cut their fundings, or most libraries rely on volunteers to even stay open. In contrast, academic institutions have started uploading their texts to a digital format for convenience and preservation reasons. While this elevated access to literature, which is very great to hear, it is still a shame to see libraries and their neighborly and competent keepers becoming out of date. Cashiers This has not been a secret for all of us. In the last few years, people have talked about the reality of a cashless society. Many advances have innovated in contactless payments, like Apple Pay and even cryptocurrencies such as Bitcoin, becoming outstanding within the society. But not everyone agrees with this new technology, with some people preferring to still use cash to better track their spending. After all, one thing is for sure, it's no longer needed for people to handle the payments. Thanks to self-service kiosk and checkouts, already a popular site in supermarket chains and popular restaurants such as McDonald's, the decrease in the amount of cashiers seems imminent. Bank Tellers we can be sure that banks won't disappear altogether, but many local branches will and already have closed. This situation will happen thanks to the convenience and user-friendly nature of online and telephone banking. It's easier to make transactions and manage your account from the comfort of your own home, bus, or practically anywhere. Banks will still remain open because people will still need to consult with financial advisors and experts. There will just be a lot less of them. Travel Agents We all have a friend that traveled around the world with a perfect itinerary, and then you found out that they did not use a travel agent. Once upon a time, if you wanted to book your summer getaway to paradisiac beaches or plan the ideal Disney World trip, you need to read a few brochures and get in touch with a sales rep to schedule everything you needed. Now there are plenty of easy to use comparison websites so that anybody can plan their own holiday. All you need is your bank card and some free time to research your destination. Sites like Skyscanner, Travago and Opoto can guide you to find the perfect flight and hotel that match your exact price and date range. Many travel operators have realized this and are closing down branches to focus on their online offers. There are still many other opportunities in the wider travel industry, though. The Print Industry The print industry includes so many jobs, from newspaper and magazine publishers to the factory workers that produce and distribute them. Some people have been speculating about the future of the print media industry for quite a time now. There has been a surge of various publication, investing more time and content into their online versions. Also, millennials prefer to get their news from less biased, less mainstream sources. This means that the industry as a whole need to adjust and evolve or officially become extinct. One thing we can be sure though is that the print newspaper's age is coming to an end. Fishermen 
The importation of seafood and farm fish are cheaper and increasingly more common. The United Kingdom and the United States have been guilty of overfishing. This causes significant problems within ecosystems. It affects food chains and survival rates of marine life. At the same time, the effects of climate change are also having an impact on the available stocks of fish. None of this looks suitable for professional fishers, which are subject to ever stricter allowances as a result of these improvements. Even the few who choose to stay in the profession will not be able to escape technology. There is research underway into fishing bots that can do the job instead of humans. What a shame, right? Telemarketers Excluding the telemarketers, of course, most people will actually be pleased about this information. Or at least they would be if the annoying unwanted sales calls weren't being replaced with even more disturbing automated sales calls. Many telemarketing companies, especially small ones that don't tend to play so close to the rules, have used this new approach that negates hiring costs and can engage potential customers at any time of the day or night. Taxi slash Uber drivers The idea of driverless cars has become very popular thanks to science fiction and James Bond movies. But as technology is improving, companies such as Waymo, Google's sister company, are getting closer to bringing one to market. This doesn't exactly bode well for those who are living thanks to their driving careers, like taxi and Uber drivers. This would be a double hit for the cab drivers, as the ride-sharing community of Uber and Lyft has already disrupted this industry just a few years ago. We just mentioned 10 jobs that would disappear in the future. So you might be wondering, what should I do instead? A report made by the tech giant Dell claims that 85% of the jobs that will be available in 2030 have not even been invented yet. This means that the technological panorama would become unrecognizable over the next 10 years. Many of the jobs in this list will also become redefined, as opposed to totally eradicated, with skills that can be transferable to other roles. Flexibility and a willingness to change a career will be an important attribute in the future job market. If you want to survive the progression and change about the job industry, the author Martin Ford recommends pursuing a career in one of the three following groups. 1. Jobs that are creative If a job requires genuine creativity, like being an artist, a scientist, or a business strategist, it is most likely to succeed. Computers are not able to replicate true human inspiration, at least not yet. 2. Jobs that are based in a relationship these roles require the building and nurturing of complicated relationships with other people, such as doctors, therapists, and other medical professionals, or business professionals that might need to develop close relationships with clients. 3. Unpredictable jobs These jobs are most likely to throw up unforeseen scenarios, such as those faced by the emergency services, or trades that could be called out to emergencies in random locations, such as plumbers or gas engineers. Thanks for watching this video. What do you think about the jobs that are most likely to disappear in the future? Let us know in the comments down below. Also, don't forget to like this video, share it with your friends and family, and subscribe to our channel. If you'd like to receive more exciting content like this, remember to turn on notifications. We'll see you in the next video.